The Christmas Academy offers um, a three-month residential developmental program and in that three months we offer them a holistic developmental program where they become physically fit, they become mentally and emotionally stronger and hopefully they are also able to connect spiritually. The first three weeks we call orientation. That's where we teach life skills. We like to call it skills to build their resiliency. We also deal with substance abuse and the negative consequences thereof. From the orientation phase, we move into the outdoor door phase. And so they leave the campus and they camp in our outdoor camp. And that is great because they hike, they swim, they do canoeing and they learn about the environment and how to protect the environment. When they come back from outdoor, they do four weeks of skills development training. So we offer things like welding, electrical circuitry, hair and grooming, office administration, computer training, public safety. So it could be quite a broad range that we offer. Then when they complete the four weeks of skills training, we have a phase called the community phase. This is where they learn to give back to their communities. So we often take them out into communities where they do work at NGOs or just general work in the community. Life before I came to the academy, as a 25-year-old young lady from a township called um, Kayamandi in Stellenbosch, I was a drug and substance and alcohol abuser. Um, I felt that at this point life had to change where I had um, wasted a lot of great opportunities. This program is a once in a lifetime opportunity, I believe. Since the second day I have been here, life has just became brighter. I just started um, filling myself with purposes, set out goals and dreams that I wanted to follow. The Chrysalis Academy is a non-profit organization. So we get funding from different sources. One source is from the provincial government of the Western Cape uh, through the Department of Community Safety. So they give us our main grant to run the program. Then we have other funders like Distel. They've been funding uh, the program for the last two years and, and that has really helped us to meet uh, all the requirements at the Chrysalis Academy. We also get uh, sponsors who perhaps will donate computers or other equipment. And then we also generate our own funding. We hire out our facilities to other youth development organizations, to churches, to private corporations. And that is another way that we generate income. Because our students, because they come from historically uh, disadvantaged areas and currently from very poor families, students don't pay to come on the course. They give a non-refundable deposit, but the course is free, so to speak. It is important for the Distel Foundation to be involved in programs of this nature because as an international company with deep roots in South Africa, we also comes a deep realization of our responsibility to help make our communities and South Africa a stable place for all to live in. And furthermore, we want to be part of that positive change in our country. We do that by partnering with projects such as the Chrysalis Academy that, gives, uh, that teaches our young people important life skills that will enable them to make healthy choices in life. To other young women and young men out there that are also have difficult um, challenges in their lives, facing obstacles, um, I would um, like to encourage you to stand up, grab opportunities in life. Chrysalis offers a very um, uplifting and life-changing experience for us youngsters as they have a mission statement of um, empowering um, young people um, through emotional, um, spiritual, physical and mental um, empowering. I would say that anything is possible if you just dream and stick to your dreams, set out goals for your life, you can make it just like I have done. Just an ordinary girl from a township, you can also make it. 
Gauteng Youth Enterprise.